Hello everyone, we meet again on IPSK TV with me, Ahmad Rais Nasrul Hafid, who is going to accompany your several time in a program of Persia. This is a program from the school institution of Ibnu Abbas Klaten that is initialed with Pesan Ramadan Santri Ibnu Abbas Klaten. So all of my honorable viewers, please permit me, Ahmad Rais Nasrul Hafid, who is standing and rising in this place, who is be being the representative from the Senior High School of Ibn Abbas Klaten to commence my speech. So I'd like to say, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillahilladzi bi ni'matihi tatimmu salihat, wa bi ahdihi ihtadal muhtadun, wa bi adlihi dhalat dhalun. Ashadu an la ilaha illallah, wa ashadu anna muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluh, la nabiya wa la rasula ba'dah. First of all, let us greeting to our God and the only God, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Because of His mercy, we can stay alive so that we can continue to our life properly. Second thing, so not being forgotten, let us greet our salawat and salam to our Prophet Rasulullah Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, who has bring our commodity from the darkness to the likeness and the brightness era until now. Amma ba'd. Night and dawn, sunset and sunrise, born and die, plenty of several events have been passed by our commodity. In a scientific diction, it means that our community have passed several of the ocean of the dimension of time. So minute by minute, hour by hour, and then over, uh, year over the year. And a nice news, a happy news come from the dimension of the time. The dimension of the time is going to bring us, is going to invite us to a holiest, to a righteous, to a special month that we know as Ramadan. Why we should call it as a righteous month and we should believe it as a holiest and special month toward Ramadan? We know that Ramadan is a month that is containing on several holiest events, such as Nuzul al-Quran as the guidance of the Muslim, and then Laylatul Qadar, that is better than thousand of years, a thousand of months. I'm sorry, and more several holy events. So this is the purpose I'm standing in this place to give a small speech about being a righter social creature in a righteous man. Firstly, we should underline that we should not neglect or ignore toward this event. I'll repeat once again. We should not neglect or ignore this event. I gotta remember a short statement from Miyamoto Musashi, that is uh, the Japanese philosopher, that said, Ichigo Ichi A. Every single opportunity is the unrepeatable experience. Even we cannot expect if this is the last Ramadan we face upon it. Nobody knows the future. Only the God and the only God, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, who knows it. And so, as a Muslim, we should prepare our preparation wisely, properly. So we should use our chance toward this Ramadan wisely and properly. You, we should not ignore and neglect toward this event. But before we start to our discussion, how to being a writer, why do I want to ask? Why do we call it as a writer or social creature? Why we add social creature in the middle of my, our statement? <laughs> social creature, by the, its definition, it means all of the human beings in this universe, whatever it is like an Asian or a European or an African, is our life in belonging on each other, are depending on each other. So we cannot live individually. And this is the fact that we cannot escape from it. So as a Muslim, we should be in harmony and not differentiate toward each other, toward any differential essences that appear in the world. Just like in the Holy Quran in Surah al hujurat in the Ayah of 13, that said, A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitan Rajim, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Ya ayyuhal nas, inna ta'alnakum min dhakarin wa utha, wa ta'alnakum shu'uba wa qaba'ila li ta'arafu, inna akramakum inda Allahi atqakum, inna wallaha alimun khabir. Surah Qawla Adim. 
it is circular to say that multicultural is the one is the part of the God destiny of the God or the God order. So any differential essence that is appear is the one of the God destiny. Like black skin or maybe brown eye or curly hair is the one of the God destiny that we should not mocking on it. So we should should not mocking toward these differences that are the problem that appears in recent day, such as racism between white skin and black skin, or maybe ethnocentrism that are appearing in in recent day, or maybe etc. So we as a Muslim should not differentiate toward each other. Because as an Indonesian, as a multicultural na nation, we have a statement, a principle statement that said, Bineka Tunggal Ika, or Unity in Diversity. And so, answering our major question, our main question, how to be a writer or social creature in this writer's mind, what, uh, are we sure to be a Japanese or maybe the scientist to being a writer or being writers? We should say no and we should not believe on it. Allah has said in the same ayah in Surah al hujurat in the ayah of 13 that said in akramakum indallahi atqaakum the most righteous people is the most it's a people that have the most scale of taqwa in his souls so it means being a righteous or social creature it means we should have an increasement of our taqwa in our soul and the discussion to today is not how to being a righteous people because we're not the god who can measure the index of taqwa properly and we should believe that the most righteous people is the or the person that is delivered by the God that is Rasulullah Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So the focus toward a uh, human is how to be a writer or social creature, how to be a better personality. And this is the purpose we are discussing on it. And so how to be a writer, uh, I want to give uh, some disclaimer that I want to give some explanation, give a description in a context of social essential or ibadah to muslim rather than uh, in a context of personal individually or ibadah to soli. First, in this like this man, I will suggest you to having a bigger scale on sadaqah. Being social, it means somebody is being used to be the helper or being the helper. And sadaqah is the way we can realize it. So it means we give another people what have we own in order to help other people or maybe like solve his problems. And in this Ramadan, it can be such as fasting, such as giving our tajil to another people. It can double your fasting with it, or maybe with a simple thing such as smiling. With smiling, we can make another people happier or being moody. Smiling is one part of the sadaqah. Tabasumuka ila ahik ila wajhi ahika sadaqah. And the second one that I want to refer to us is do a good deed, or we we known as amar ma'ruf nahi munkar. We are not alive individually. We should be helped or being the helper. And being a better community is the way better than be only being a better personality. And Amar Maruf Nahimunkar, it can be assumed as asking other people to work a workshop and asking other people to avoid any forbidden things. We can give you uh, some explains, uh, some examples such as if you are hearing Adanas right now, and you want to invite your friends to pray Arsa together, so your good deed will be doubled. And in this month, in the month of Ramadan, your good deed will be mega, mega doubled. So you can earn, you can receive your double good deed just only with the way speaking in order to Amar Ma'ruf Nahi Munkar. Second things, last but not least, I will really suggest you to being active on social. It means we should have a big contribute to our, uh, the social essential that are appearing in the in this world. It can be such as first thing uh, like uh, joining an uh, Islamic teaching or maybe doing some charity because this is the way we can you can strong the solidarity or uha islamiyah between our social relationship or maybe brotherhood, familyhood, neighborhood, and etc. Because this is the best opportunity on Ramadan. 
and those are three things that we we can discuss in this in this section and those are a few tips from a thousand tips how to be a writer how to be a better person in a context of social essential or maybe in context of personal individual and we can in this section we can conclude three things that we have discussed about it the first one is be give a bigger scale on sedekah or in bahasa we said it memperbanyak sedekah the second thing is going a good deed or amar ma'ruf nahi mungkar or in bahasa we said it as uh, mengajak kepada kebaikan dan mencegah pe kepada ke kemungkaran the second thing last but not least is being active on social activities uh, in bahasa we said that uh, Andil dalam kegiatan sosial. To end of my speech, I want to say that it doesn't matter if you started in a small scale, cause the the strong ones do what they can do, and the weak suffer what they must. And I want to say uh, plenty of sorry with all of the mistakes that I have delivered to you, and a plenty of thank you uh, for your all na of nice attention. And we hope for the best experience on Ramadan in this year. I'm Ahmad Raiz Nasrul Hafid. I want to say, Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.